Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Fox News contributor Sarah A. Carter reports FBI Director Christopher Wray, along with the Justice Department, are pressuring the White House to redact all names in the FISA abuse memo prior to its release. Breaking: FBI Director Christopher Wray and DOJ wants all names redacted from FISA memo, putting pressure on White House and House Intelligence Committee. Government officials say, is releasing names a threat to national security? Tweeted Carter. As the Gateway pundits Jim Hoff reported, Carter told Fox News host Sean Hannity Wednesday that there was a concerted effort by the intelligence community to block the release of the memo. According to earlier reports, five FBI officials visited the White House this week and revised the House intelligence memo. Sarah Carter, it appears there is a concerted effort on the part of the FBI members of the intelligence community and the Department of Justice to try to force the president to delay the release of the memo. And they're doing this to buy time, according to sources that I've spoken with so that they can leak information to try to find a way to either discredit the memo or placate the members of the DOJ that don't want to see this released." Former Secret Service agent Dan Bongino pointed out that it is ironic that the FBI is battling to mask the names of government officials involved in the unmasking of Trump team officials in an illicit spying operation. CBS News contributor Fran Townsend reported Thursday that Ray has prepared a full rebuttal of the memo if released by the Trump administration. I think we have to remember the Nunes memo is an advocacy piece. It's not a fact piece. This is Chairman Nunes' summary of what he believes the abuses are. For that reason, it's one-sided, Townsend told CBS News. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.